Hi guys, welcome to Silly Makeup Saturday. So I got a comment that challenged me to do a full face of blush. So that's what we're gonna be doing today. I only have primer on my face and I'm over here like in my blushes trying to figure out what I'm gonna use for foundation. I think I'm gonna use my number seven because it's like, it's a very a light color. I'm, I have so little left, but I'm hoping this can be... <gasps> I just squirt... Oh my gosh. You got, I mean, you guys saw. Okay. Okay. I thought it was empty, and then all of a sudden it had like a giant burst. Okay. Um, let's clean that up. Okay. Yeah. This is like exactly what I was hoping for. It's such a light and subtle color that it goes on my very light skin. Okay, we are immersed. I mean, that was probably what the hardest one. Okay. Okay, I'm not sure that it really gave any coverage, but I have another shade of this number seven. This one's coral. This is definitely a lot darker, but I'm hoping if I use like a small amount, maybe this can be concealer. The formula is so like creamy, so I'm hoping it can kind of not look like I have pink under eyes. Okay, I usually blend out my under eyes with my finger. I did the other ones with a beauty blender, but I'm just trying to honestly do this how I would do my makeup. Yes, this formula, like I would not do this with like Rare Beauty because that would be so pigmented and on me it would look ridiculous, but this is not looking really that terrible. Okay. I don't have a good one for cream, but I will use Rare Beauty for... Guys, I'm going to be crazy and use two dots to show you how extreme this is. I think I need more on this side. Okay, bronzer. I'm using this. It's from Kenia Ontiveros. So like all three of these are blushes, but that looks like it could be a bronzer on me. Yeah, I feel like this is totally going to kind of warm my face up. Okay, and while I'm in here, I'm going to just kind of put some of this one on my eyebrow spoolie just to like kind of fill the brows in a little bit this is the closest thing I have to like a brown I'm aware it's a little bit reddish but when you're doing a full face of blush like what else would you expect okay just adding some more peach powder on top of the blush I have just to set that Okay, I'm feeling very peachy. Okay, for eyes, I'm going to use my e.l.f. putty blush, like this hot pink one, and then top it with this like rodeo blush drops because this is a little more like glowy and see if I can make something look cute. Okay, I think I'm just going to use my finger. Oh yeah, these are so pigmented. They're so creamy. It feels great. Okay, now I'm adding the blush drops. Just thought I would give it like a pretty shine. Yeah, you can see that. Kind of gives it like the wet effect. Okay. 
Okay, I'm gonna add a wing with this blush from this little W7 palette. I'm just trying to use as many different blushes as possible. Okay, that's what I'm going for, just a little wing and kind of smudging it out underneath. Okay, for lips, I'm gonna use this powder from Ciate and then top it with this cream one from Tarte. I'm hoping this can kind of be like almost a gloss, but I don't know how that's gonna work out. I don't even know like how to apply this. I'm using kind of like a fluffy brush to like pick it up. It's getting really powdery. I might have to spray my brush, but it's giving me some color. Okay, this is sprayed. Okay, I think that gives me like more pigment. Okay. I feel like it looks different on my lips than it does on my cheeks, as far as the color, which is so interesting. I would have obviously never known. Okay, this is kind of a cute color. Okay, the only thing is I can feel how like powdery <laughs> they are, which is why I wanted to use my cream like over top. It's like so balmy, but my lips are straight powder dry, so. Okay, this might actually be working. The way that this looks so different on my lips is so crazy. Like I consider both of those blushes to be almost like a deeper color on me, more like a berry. Um, but on the lips it almost looks like a nude or something. I was not expecting that. Okay, here is the final look. My full face using blush. Um, I mean, honestly, it turned out so much better than I thought. That first one that I used like for foundation actually like matches my skin pretty much. I think everything like looks cute. Why is this actually like a really good lip combo? Anyways, what do you think? Would you try it? Would you do a full face of blush? I totally would. I, I want to wear some of these combos again.